Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Overtime. Did you guys notice anything different about my signature move there? You spun the other way, didn't I you? I did. Oh, First time to spin right. But we have an extra special episode for you guys today. And make sure you stay tuned till the very end because we are giving away our brand new Duke Perfect Basketball. Wow. Woo! No, him started it. Now it starts. <laughs> oh, you guys are going to make me look silly. Tall guy, beard, twins, purple hoser. Dude, perfect in overtime. Tall guy, beard, twins, purple hoser. Now we're heading on to overtime. You guys want to know just like an extra cool fact about this episode? You're going to tell us either way. I don't know if you knew this or not, but if you take your mic and you turn it upside down, all of a sudden, your voice becomes super deep. Oh, wow. Yeah. That's amazing. And then if you turn it to the right. It goes helium mode. Oh, yes! Okay. Whew. Feels good to be back to normal. Okay, let's dive right into the first segment and a brand new one at that. Awkward situations. Hello. Awkward. All right, here's how it's gonna work. Typically, you walk into the front door of our office and it's a lobby. Today, you walk into the front door of our office and you walk into an occupied bathroom. Oh. Awkward. <laughs> okay, what do you guys say we head downstairs? Here we go. We're in the middle of filming the third season of our TV show and there's a new girl who's about to walk in. <laughs> this is her first day. Oh, welcome to the office. Oh, man. <gasps> oh, I feel bad. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I'm so confused. Is that Tyler? How would you put a bathroom on it? Coach, how you feeling? Sitting on a toilet? God, he's such a weirdo. <laughs> oh. Sorry. Just, I just need a minute. <laughs> that out <worked out> awkward. <laughs> you, come on in, I need my food if you don't mind. Oh. If, if you're not worried about it, I'm not. Okay. Take care, buddy. Oh, sorry. Hey, sorry, this door's broken. Oh, that other broken? one should work to your left. Okay. okay. Oh, sorry, man. Somebody's in here. Oh, so what went through your head when you opened the door? Uh, this is not the right door. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Whew. I feel like you can almost smell the awkward in there. <laughs> oh. Whew. Man. Well, now it is time to head to everybody's, but mainly Corey's least favorite oh. segment, <laughs> Wheel Unfortunate. Mm. So for those of you following along at home, you may recall that Corey has been selected randomly for the last three Wheel Unfortunates. That is unfortunate. That is very unfortunate. <laughs> Let's make it four, baby! So in fairness to Corey, who no longer trusts us, <laughs> we've decided to mix up the mojo and we're gonna bring in a guest picker, okay? Calling in to help us out, one of the best football players in the game, Rob Gronkowski! Let's go! Yeah. What's up, bro? What up, dudes? <laughs> All right, Gronk, we know you're busy with football and the cool new Good Rewards charity campaign from Honey Nut Cheerios, so we appreciate you doing this. Yeah, man, definitely busy, but I'm excited to be here to help you guys out today, especially you, Corey. Thank you, okay. Gronk, I appreciate it. All right, Gronk, we've got a bowl in front of you that's got all five of our names in it. We need you to pick one name out, and that is the person that will be spinning Wheel Unfortunate. Okay, here we go. Oh, okay. You guys ready? I can't look. Oh. Barely. Garrett! Yes! 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 Love this game show. Gronk, great job. You definitely helped Corey out. I'm sure he's very appreciative. Uh, if you're ever in Dallas and you want to stop and hang out, let us know. Appreciate it, man. Sounds like fun. Oh, by the way, that Forrester, I'm a huge fan. Nice! Of All right. right. I'm sure he'll be happy I'll to hear that. Thanks, later. Gronk. Rob Gronkowski, everybody! Hey, hey, Garrett Hilbert, everybody! Hey, yeah. <laughs> I just don't understand why we changed what was working for us. <laughs> oh. Whoa, Rob, that's some high praise coming from you. Gonna just, whoo, gonna have to power through this one, eh? Ladies and gentlemen, I'm Dan Forrester, and it is stupendous to 
to be here with you today on the set of the greatest game show in all the land as I just got word that we were nominated for the greatest game show posted online in Monday afternoon. So truly, from the bottom of my heart, thank you very much. It means a lot. We have got a great show for you today. A special guest, I actually got word it's not Corey. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for Garrett Ilbert! For being a first-timer on the show. Here you go. Also, for being a first-timer, have a little Ned Forcer Golden Boy. How about that? I have four of these. Well, then I'm sure a sixth one couldn't hurt. <laughs> you still not satisfied, really? Goodness no. gracious, you need another one? I mean, what's it gonna take to put a smile on your face? Still not sad. You need another one, Gare? Come on now. <laughs> this oh. is plenty. This completes my collection. That's enough? Can't get enough of that. Let's, let's just get this over. Don't ever do that again. <laughs> Gare, hold my mic, please. Okay! Ned, is that chest hair natural? Chest hair is not natural. The regular hair is natural. Hey, you know what I just realized? A couple of red-headed brothers. Oh. Yeah. I'm very sorry about that. Kids, that is why you don't use too much hair gel in seventh and eighth grade. <laughs> Careful with that stuff. All right, Gare! Spin that wheel! A good spin, Gare. Well, good news, you're not gonna have to get frosted tips because that could be awkward. <laughs> but you will have to run a mile as a mascot! All right, Gare! Am I literally gonna have to put a mascot costume on and run a mile? That is what it says, Gare. Why don't you join me in saying that unfortunate! That's Ned signing off for now. All right, Gear, we are exactly one mile from the office. I hope you know how to get back. You didn't tell me this was gonna be in public. All right, so just take off. Yeah, see ya. Hey, there's another runner, look. How's it going, man? <laughs> oh, he smiled. Absolutely embarrassing. How's it going? <laughs> oh, I gotta catch up to my buddy up there, hold on. Hey, you won't pass him. <laughs> it's, it's not sprint a mile. <laughs> He's flying. Show him how it's done, wizard. Go, Gary. Go. Oh, yes. Nice. It's good pet. It's good pet. Dude, look at the mutual respect there. Nice. Look at Gary go. Well done, Gary! <laughs> Dude, that looks amazing. <laughs> it's not every day you get passed by a wizard, you know? It's the best consequence of all time. Oh, I think I see a wizard hat. I see the tip of a wizard hat bouncing over the vehicles. Gary! There he is! Finish strong. Oh, there it is. There it is. Oh. <laughs> That's how that works. I passed the guy though. I saw amazing. that. Yeah. We saw that. That was nice. All right, Gare, how was your first time at the wheel? Sweaty. Nice. I did enjoy running past that jogger though. That was, that was amazing. Good. That was a good that time. Good. I, that kind of boosted the confidence yeah. a little bit. Special thanks to Honey Nut Cheerios and Gronk for helping us out with this segment of Wheel Unfortunate. Make sure you click the link in the description below to support Team Gronk and find out more about the Good Rewards program. All right, coming up next. Cool, not cool. Yeah. <laughs> Who should start us off in this cool, not cool? I'll start us off, man. I've been working on it. I want to introduce you guys to the air conditioned jacket. You might be saying, it's summer, why wear a jacket? Does it, does it blow up? Oh, he's inflating! Whoa! I'm telling you right now, my body temperature just dropped five degrees. Can I, can I feel the jacket? Oh yeah, hey, feel the air coming oh, out of there. Cool. Oh wow, that is a lot of air. Yeah. Hey, I'll give it to you. I already gave it to I you. I like it. I would say another plus is, dude, you look jacked. Yeah, yeah. Could you sleep you. in it? Oh yeah, on your side or something. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> because you can sleep in it? Okay, I was gonna go green initially, but I did make a rule a long time ago that I would never wear zip off pants or oh, jackets. Wow. Oh, that hurt. It wasn't easy, I'm sorry folks at home. Uh, moving right along, uh, Kobe, would you like to go next? And we'll just go down the line. Today, I have a bucket of sunglasses. You're gonna need to put these on. Why? Gentlemen, I proudly present the world's strongest handheld laser. Oh, <laughs> oh, it is certainly bright. Yeah. Okay. Very, very bright, very, very dangerous. Sunglasses feel like a good choice. Cody, you will find underneath the desk two balloons that I have placed there for no, this demonstration. Cody, please hold the balloon in front of you. I'm kind of nervous. Of okay, are you ready? Balloon. What's going to happen? Oh! Oh, oh man! No! He's that, not. ladies and gentlemen, is not magic. That is the one. Do it again! Do it again! Another laser! Here we go. If this Thank pops, you. I am super cool. Oh! Oh! No! Okay. 
Hi. Ty, you will find under your chair a box of matches. No way! No way! I think we all know hey, where we're headed with this. Sorry, sorry. Safety. All right, Ty, are you set? Are you moving? I need I, you to be still. Yeah, I'm still. Okay. No way. Oh! oh! I rest no! my case. Thank you. Bobby Cotton, you have just erased a lifetime of poor, cool, not cool decisions. Is that your first super cool product? Gotta be. Absolutely. <laughs> gotta be. <laughs> gotta be. My cool thing for today. The Dude Perfect Backpack. Comes inside the Dude Perfect uh, Backpack. Huh? Raise your hand if you had a rubber band gun growing up. Of course I did. Oh, yeah. You'll love fully automatic no rubber way. band gun. Oh. Check no that way. out. Fully that automatic, there's a little iron sight. Oh! Yes! It's so much better yes! than I thought! Wow! What do you say? I'm gonna cut huh? this thing again. Yes! Can I shoot it one time? Probably took me 30 minutes just to put each band in. <laughs> 30 minutes of reload? Really an hour's Wait, did you cool my fish flops? I did. I did! No, I did! Did you? You already voted. You can't unvote. I don't think you did. No, I did. I remember, I love I love largemouth yeah. bass. <laughs> Too late, already decided. <laughs> Are you all ready to end on a good note? I am. Ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to introduce you. It's a bazooka! Oh! <laughs> yes! Yes! This not only shoots amazing rings that you can see, <laughs> but it's got power. Oh! No way! <laughs> Go! Rapid fire rings. Not today. No! Rapid fire rings! No shot! Way! Right. Can we all at the same time? Three! Two, one, and well done, Corey! Thanks, guys. Thank Very you. Very nice. Hey, cool Not Cool has gone to the next level. Done. All right, it is time to head to the next segment, a brand new one at that, Wives vs. Chad. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the long-awaited series, Wives vs. Chad. Wives, it is great to have you. Please join us in welcoming Allison Jones, Amy Cotton, and Bethany Tony for the first time on the Overtime Set. Of course, as you all know and love, one of our all-star editors, Chad Terrell. Big round of applause for Chad there. That's awesome. Great to have you guys. Today on Wives vs. Chad, we've decided to have a little sports trivia segment. How about we get a little background on each contestant? Sports could disappear tomorrow, and I would have no idea. Once, I even played fantasy football, but my parents did everything for me, but I ended up getting second. <laughs> I have two kids and no time for sports. For an interview with DP, they asked me on how much I like sports on a scale of 1 to 10. I said 6. That was a lie. It's more like a 2. <laughs> okay. And ladies and gentlemen, those are the contestants today on Wives vs. Chad. What do you guys say we dive into a little sports trivia? How many runs are in a Grand Slam? Is this football or it's baseball? It's baseball. <laughs> it's baseball. Well, there's four bases. Oh, gosh. <laughs> girls, what is your final answer? Four. four. Chad. I answered way too fast. <laughs> <laughs> OK, the correct answer is four. Congratulations, Yay! girls. You're going to learn pretty quick here that the points don't matter, and uh, we're just having a little fun. So next question, how many points is a safety worth? I think it's either I two, it's one, or six. Girls, how many points is a safety? Two. All right, all around. <laughs> Very nice. OK, next question. What is a double-double? Chad seems uh, pretty happy with his answer. <laughs> and Chad, what did you say a double-double is? A burger in and out <laughs> Half a point to Chad. Well done. Very nice. Name one current baseball player. No chance. <laughs> I say we move on, Chad. How about you? OK, all right. Ladies, please explain to me second and five. Two are down, two people have fallen. <laughs> oh, not people. <laughs> two plays down, five yards to go. Down yes. like they're done. I'm going to give it to them. All right. OK. Here we go. Here's another person question. Who is Lamar Odom? He was married to a Kardashian. Yeah, basketball. Chad, let's start with you. Who is Lamar Odom? Sports. <laughs> <laughs> I like it. Very nice. Girls, who is Lamar Odom? Played for the LA Lakers. He, but then he got in trouble. Got in trouble. Went to Dallas for like a season. Oh, he did. Didn't do great. <laughs> he did. He didn't do great. I am blown away by the talent level here at Wives vs. Chad. We are headed to the final round, the lightning round. I will ask a question. You buzz in at any moment that you feel led to and shout out your answer. Stop. Okay. <laughs> Name 
four positions in baseball. Amy, she's a baseball wizard. Hitter, first base, left field, catcher. What a way to get there, but she does it. What is the mascot of the Oakland Raiders? A Raider? Ding, 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 ding. <laughs> Chad, seeing through the trick question, well done. And we will end it on this. A wrist shot would commonly be found in what sport? Basketball. Incorrect. What? Frisbee. <laughs> no. <laughs> Keep buzzing in, yes. Soccer. No. <laughs> yes. No. <laughs> yes. Golf? Ah. No. What? <laughs> Tennis. No! Lacrosse. No! Yes. Is there any other sport? Yes, there is! Oh! Oh! Hockey! Yes! yes. <laughs> Woo! Well done, girls and Chad. Very nice. So who won? The real winner was learning. Knowledge. <laughs> Knowledge was the real winner today. We are proud of you guys. We love you dearly. Thank you for being participants on Wives First, Chad. Thank you very much. We'll see you next time! That was enjoyable. Oh, man. Okay, well, last but not least, it's giveaway time! Yes. If you are a subscriber and you share this video, we will be picking 10 of you wow. to give away the brand new Dude Perfect Basketball. Oh. There it is. Congratulations to the winners from last time's giveaway. Here they are. Nice. Congrats. I'm still in the running to get my free basketball. Yeah. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see, Gare. All right, if you want to buy a basketball for yourself, click right here. If you want to see the last video, click down here. Signing off for now. We'll see you next time on Overtime, all the time. Oh, wow. Yeah. Oh, big oh. mic. <laughs> nice. Oh, the big mic. Yeah.